Hello guys, Adam Antium here, bringing you episode 6 of our Crew to the Kings 2 playthrough with the Old Do the old Gods DLC. And we were playing as Jorvik, but in the last episode, even though my computer messed it up, uh, we did create the the Pagan Kingdom of Ireland as Halfton, Ragnus and Hesvistirk, um, our original player, so that's good. Um, it also means that now, well we had them before, but we can declare war for conquest of... Uh, any of these, um, we can still declare one of these guys, even though I believe we might have a peace treaty here till, uh, till this year, so we can go to war with them this year. Uh, Wessex I don't think we have a treaty with, so I can declare war on those next, uh, which I think I probably will do. Oh this guy, is this guy an ally of mine? Oh yeah he is, oh, he, well he's powerful anyway. So I don't want to really be messing with him yet, quite yet. Um, let's have a look what we've got. So we've got one week claim. I don't want to see that anymore. Title loss and secession. We know about that because it goes to our son. So we can create the Duchy of Ulster, the Duchy of Connacht and the Duchy of Munster. Oh, wrong button. Oh, what have I done? Um, which lands do I... Oh, I keep pressing the wrong button. I've just been playing... Uh, um, I've just been playing... Uh, run to war 2 and you use the WASD pad to kind of move around on that and I've been that's what I'm pressing here so we have this one Jorvik, Dunholm, Northumberland and that uh, and who owns these guys this is my son or my grandson who owns that one uh, I'm not gonna bother creating any of those titles they can do that I can prestige claims fine and dangerous factions this guy wants independence um, so we'll put our. Oh, he might. He's already there. Yeah. I think there. And uh, we'll keep an eye on that one. We'll get rid of that one. What's our military situation look like? Okay. So we need to just give it a rest. So we'll just let it run through and see what happens. Okay. So limited crown authority, which is good. Um, okay. Uh, I actually found out thanks to someone in the comments. Um, that because I'm a pagan it'll always be Galvalkai in succession unless I, I assume I convert to Christianity um, which is I suppose it's going to be fine the kingdom's always going to pass to me but it means that my sometimes my sons and heirs might gain more oops, more land than I do so it can kind of lead to ah, I'm doing it again possible <laughs> threats uh, in the future where's this guy Norfolk, ah, okay, so he belongs to Mercia, or of Mercia. Um, so yeah, so we'll continue and let it play. I haven't played in this game for ages, actually. It's been a, a while. I don't, oh yeah, I have Cornwall down here. Is he... He's independent, yeah. I can't declare war on him till November, but I might do... October, sorry. I might do that just because I can. And I can easily beat him. Oh, Wessex. Ah, I've clicked on the... I know what I've done. So the, con the cook complained to me about Ragnar's temper tantrums. Apparently he points to her son in the face again. So Ragnar's my son. If she, the kids show spirit, so Roth. So Roth gives him free martial, minus intrigue and diplomacy, that could be good. Beat him into being calm. Kids patient. Plus one to all. And periphery soul. So he'll lose Roth. I think we'll give him Roth because I don't want him to have good intrigue and I don't want, really want people to like him. So. Uh, so we've got a child that needs guardian, my daughter, uh, educate child, we'll give it to this guy, because it'll get a plus 20, it'll get him above into the green. Okay, and we'll play on. Oops, uh, looks like these two are in a war. Norfolk, ah, uh, I don't want him getting Norfolk, to be honest. If he gains land in England, then it means I can't become the king of England. Or I, well, I can, but it won't be as easy to. Uh, which will just lead to conflicts, and he's quite strong. Okay, my least, uh good, so it's been a success. So he likes me, so hopefully he won't want to. Well, the faction warning has gone away, so that's very encouraging. Oh. What's this? Uh, Call to arms, so my brother. Uh, I will declare.
decline, I don't want to get involved in. Well, I could have kept it and kept my prestige, but it'll be fine. Yeah, so they must be fighting over here somewhere. Um, looks like he's going to take that. It looks like Wessex has come up into Mercia. And I might actually, let's see. So I've got that many. How many has this guy got? Let's go through his realm tree. So he's got less than me, I've got some money. He's got the same amount of money as me, pretty much. Uh, I'll let it run for a little bit. He might get involved in this war and therefore like lose a few troops, which would be handy if he does. Okay, so that's our domain. I don't really want to lose. So it's saying title loss and succession, I'll use, lose Jorvik. But if I grant him Jorvik, it means I should get it next, I think. Oh, this guy sucks. Oh, he's got Diligent, that's not bad. Brave, honest, is okay. Uh, because otherwise, I don't know where my county will leave. So, um, oh, and I can't because he's, yeah, he's in someone else's court. Okay. Okay, my wife's pregnant, good. Looks like Mercia's gonna get beat. And I believe we can declare war on them now. Yeah, they've got a new liege. Declare war, come to Cheshire, Derby. Be much better if he could just <laughs> take over. <laughs> uh, but we'll go for... Let's see how much money they all earn. 31. 27, 35, right, we'll go for Chester then. Declare war, conquest of Chester. Okay, we'll raise our... Uh, we'll just raise our troops for now. And just see how we do. Because they're, they're at war, so they shouldn't have many troops anyway. Might need to raise a few levies just for the, um, the siege, if they have a lot of troops. Okay. Discovered a plot, okay, thank you. Uh, will you end your plot? You will, great, okay. And we'll merge these, we'll give them some good troops. Oh, wrong button. I don't want to be the leader. I don't want to be in it at all, actually, because I don't want to be killed in battle. And then we'll match them. I'm just going to close my curtain if you hear a strange noise. Yeah, so he's going to stop his plot, great. I uh, can siege here, so I'll just do that. So she's a plot as well to kill me. She'll give in, good. I won't have to kill my sister-in-law. Yeah, good. Okay, so if we can see just quickly, we'll be able to probably win the war quickly as well. And then if we can, we'll take on Northampton. Uh, let me just see what... Uh, how do I do it? Suffolk. Dijon, East Anglia, ah oh, that's okay. I didn't want him to have like a dukedom, be able to claim that and then get a dukedom and claim like Northampton, because then he'd come to war with me, which I wouldn't want. What I like, I call him, Snake Eye. Okay, Gerda, the daughter. Okay, so they're getting quite a few troops there. Wolfred, a courtier, that's no big deal I suppose. So, the spectre of hunger is ever present for fear for the defenders. The cruel arithmetic of a siege means that as the defenders of Chester starve to death, there is more food for those that remain. The hunger bites, so they take more loss. Good. Uh, I can't stop thinking of all those prisoners in my dungeon. They're at my complete mercy. What a it would be to hurt, to hurt them to hear them sweet screams, to see the panic in their eyes. Uh, no, oh, oh, <laughs> press wrong button. Uh, what prisons do I have in here? Oh, I've got three, so I've got, can we ransom? Yeah. I should have kept her, actually. No. No. Okay. We'll keep them for the uh, next bolt.
Okay, so we should finish the siege. Artists serving. Okay, got Wolfhild and her. Okay, so we've got to see the church in the town now and hopefully we'll get it. So my liege, my liege, my mission to Cumberland is so finally being a success. So this guy likes me again. Uh, that rock, can we sell her? Yes. Uh, Wolfhild? No. Do, oop, do I get anything if I release her? No. Uh, okay, so this guy's the title City of Lynn. What's this? City of Lynn here. that was glowing because I was at war with him for it but it was just because I clicked on it which is fine okay so we'll beat these and then we'll go and see Jem uh, let her rot okay okay we get a minus should, should beat them hopefully hopefully yep okay my grandson became Legal age, can I get him married to anyone good? Um, Prince of Ireland. No, don't really want to do that. Um, let's go. I think it's become the King of Denmark. Chiefess, Priestess. Um, No one really good. Let's see, she's nah, she too old. Uh, we'll go for this girl if she'll marry me. I'll marry my grandson, that'll be fine. Okay, so we beat them. Uh, off back to Cheshire. Oh no, what am I doing? Chasing the wrong troop. Okay, so he's left for uh, somewhere. Smallpox in Cumberland, that's fine if they go to Cumberland. Prince Adam Manitum is now of legal age, he became a school tactician. Cool. Okay, so we're getting married to someone. Uh, she's quite young. Cartier. Princess would be good. Priestess, priestess. I wonder if there's anyone in this guy's household who I can marry. Um, how old is that? 12. Uh, Range Patrol. His daughter and me. Yes, and get us an alliance with them, so hopefully it'll prevent them declaring war on me anytime soon. Oh, has he died? Oh, good. Well, not good because he was a good spy master, but good because um, he's the one who didn't like me. And can I click on his kingdom? He doesn't like me either. Fine, okay. So we'll get married, or I'll get betrothed. Okay, victory back down here to hopefully take out that army on the way. Victory. We'll come down to this one. And we'll finish the siege off and hopefully oh consumption that's not good. Should win the war and then we'll probably go to war with Cornwall and then Northampton and then whilst we're waiting for peace we'll try and finish off at the rest of conquering the rest of Ireland. Okay, knowledge has gone up, good. Uh actually beat his army. Okay, he wants the peace. Uh surrender. Okay, accept. So I've usurped his title and match our men back. So who's this guy? That's not in my domain anyway, so that's fine. Um, st 
send our troops down. And then we shall uh, give out Chester. Chester. Macclesfield. <laughs> Things aren't worth very much. Um, so, what do we want? Find characters. Search realm. Men. In prison. No. Married. Any. Ruler. No. My religion. Yes. And the one who likes me the most. Adam Anderson. So, my sons. He's quite old. He, their family. Okay, he'll do. Quite a landed title. And we want to give him the County of Cheshire. Okay. So he gains that. Good. And we'll play on. There's a lot of disease around. Uh, so I believe we can go to war with these guys. Oops. And we'll probably go for Northampton just because it links all our realm up. Um, and then let's have a look at Cornwall, the Duke. He has one ally. Can't you soon again? So I don't really have to worry about that. We can conquer him for that. He doesn't have many troops. 500. I've got more than enough, but I'll just let a little bit of time run. Get a bit more money in as well. We're looking like here. Um, anything I want to build? Let's give four level levy size. Cavalry, galleys. Uh, we'll upgrade that because we've got a bit of money. Just get us a few more heavy infantry, which always comes in helpful. Uh, this guy's finally the faction. Just get rid of all these, this crap. Okay, and we'll play on. Pressing the buttons again. Now. Yeah, that's so that one's that one. Shortcut for that is W. Okay, so there's never been a shortage of troops. Great news. And since we've got that, we will declare war. Conquest of Cornwall. We'll raise our troops. We'll raise our levy. We won't need all of them. Get rid of these few. Get rid of this guy as well, just so he doesn't get beat. Uh, so that guy, where is he? Oh, wrong button. That is somewhere over there, that's fine. <coughs> Vassals are whining. Okay, we'll match our troops into there. Uh, Bishop Conn, a preacher in the service of Queen Alien of Scotland, has arrived in Yorvik. So we've had this one before. Do we either let him spread Christianity or not? Uh, so that lets him. Uh, spread it, and that's not. We don't want to be Christian, so we're not going to spread it. Oh, so Stuart died. What did he die of? Yeah, consumption. Damn. Okay, so I'll try and get a steward. Oh, he's good. Uh, he's currently fighting. But we'll have him. We'll have him oversee construction. I'll try and take this army out. They're a bit smaller than me, so they're going to be a pain. Uh, we'll let him rot, but we will. Uh, can we release him? No. Oh, press the wrong button again. Okay, we'll sell him. Right, caught that army. Yeah, good.
Okay, so we'll just start sieging. Okay, my granddaughter came of age. Can we get her married off to anyone? Um, she's quite good intrigue. I might see if I can get her married into my court. Whoops. Oh, I'll never find her now. So who was it? This girl. Right. Uh, arranged marriage. Oh, with all these old men. Uh, let's see if we can find her a, a husband. Man married now, ruling now. My religion, yes. Search all. Um, anyone with good traits who will marry her matrilineally. I just touched. Oh, what's up, man? Marriage. It's lineal, yes. Okay, so that means he'll come to my car and my daughter, my granddaughter, stay in my car as well. She's good. Okay. So I might be able to get her to be my spy. Uh, she won't be as high as him. Uh, he's better though. He doesn't like me very much. So. Okay. So we'll siege out Cornwall and Again, another thing. Why righteous imprisonment? Who's this guy? Uh, what's he doing? Is he a faction leader? No. He's Newcastle. Maybe that's it. Okay, so another son. Getting my wife. So that who's that get us? Ignore. Any cartridges? Hmm. Quite one of princess because I'd like to be able to try and get some. Um, to anyone. Nothing. Um we'll marry him to her. Well betrothed him. Okay, good. Right, let's try and siege out this castle. Okay, so he's no longer back in the plot, which is good for him. It still says I can imprison him. Uh, acted dishonorably just towards me. Oh, oh, okay. I didn't mean to press that. What, wait, what did he do? So he's in my prison. Can I release him? Yeah, I can. I'll get a thingy boost, so that's fine with me. Dangerous factions. Yes, so this guy, Northumbria. However, ill is. He's reconverted, so this is both North. That's the Anglo Saxon. And Catholic. But we're getting there. At least. Okay, so how much longer we got on the siege? Not much. Okay, drag her out. Okay, betrothed. Yes. Uh, Miss Cumberland, so I found a bit of success in my visit to Count, so he likes me more. Plus 40, good. What's this? Yes, it was just. No, we don't want to marry Matrilin me. Doesn't matter when it does this. Okay, so they've got married anyway. Fine. Peace. So he surrenders. Okay. 
Okay, we won our land. We can stand our troops down. Get, get rid of that. Um, who owns this one? This guy. He likes me a hundred. Um, do I want to give him Cornwall? He has an heir. Yeah, fine. Let's give him Cornwall. Uh, and all the lower titles. Can't leave Cornwall. And I believe he should be able to make the duchy. Uh, yeah. If he has the money, he can do that. That's fine. And we shall see if he does that in the next episode, guys. Uh, I'm going to end this one here. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure you leave the video a like. Um, and if you have any tips or questions for me, make sure you leave them in the comments below. And if you like my videos and want to see more Crusader Kings or FIFA or the Rum Total War or Pokemon Mo, make sure you subscribe to my channel. So thanks a lot guys and we'll see you in the next episode.